Dear students, in this topic, we shall discuss the neuroendocrine role of hypothalamus. The hypothalamus is the part of brain which has dual role as neuronal as well as endocrine tissue. It has specialized neurosecretory cells which produce hormones. There are two categories of hypothalamic hormones. First are the hypophysiotropic hormones and the other are the neurohypophysial hormones. First we shall discuss the hypophysiotropic hormones. Seven hypothalamic hormones act on anterior pituitary gland that is adenohypophysis. They regulate the secretion of adenohypophysial hormones. These hormones of hypothalamus are of two types. First, the hypothalamic releasing hormones and number two, the hypothalamic inhibiting hormones. The releasing hormones of hypothalamus stimulate the secretory activity of anterior pituitary. These hormones include number one, the corticotropin releasing hormone or CRH that stimulates the ACTH release from anterior pituitary. The second hormone is the growth hormone releasing hormone GHRH. It stimulates the release of growth hormone. The third hormone is the gonadotropin releasing hormone which stimulates the release of FSH and luteinizing hormone from adenohypophysis. The fourth hormone is the thyrotropin releasing hormone or TRH that stimulates the production of TSH from anterior pituitary. In addition to this, TRH also stimulates the secretion of prolactin. There are three hypothalamic inhibiting hormones which inhibit the secretory activity of anterior pituitary. These include number one, the MSH inhibiting hormone or MIH that inhibits the secretion of melanocyte stimulating hormone. The second inhibiting hormone is the prolactin inhibiting hormone or PIH. And the third hormone is the somatostatin that inhibits the release of growth hormone. Dear students, hypothalamic hormones bohot thodi concentration me anterior pituitary ke upar bada effect rakhte hain. So they are effective in very low concentration. It is because of close proximity and direct portal connection between the hypothalamus and anterior pituitary. Anterior pituitary bilkul hypothalamus ke saath linked hai. Yehi waja hai ke in me portal connection yani ke blood ka connection bhi direct hai aur close bhi hai. Is liye bo thode se hormones bhi pituitary ke upar kaafi bada asar rakhte hai. Dear students, now we shall discuss the neurohypophysial hormones of hypothalamus. These hormones include oxytocin and antidiuretic hormone that is also known as vasopressin. These hormones are 
synthesized by the hypothalamus and they are released directly in the posterior pituitary because the exone terminals of neurosecretory cells of hypothalamus lie in the posterior lobe of the pituitary that is called neurohypophysis. The posterior lobe of pituitary stores these hormones and releases them as per requirement to act directly on their target tissues.